Frank, I'm just following up on your messages. Yeah, I just want to see how you're doing without Damien around. I know we did a lot when you were at work, and you have to pick up the slack lately. No, no, I, I don't care about that. I'm just a little distracted thinking about where he is. I'm more upset about his wife than anything I was talking to earlier today, and uh, she's sounding more worried as this goes on. Look, Rodney, there's something else I gotta tell you. State regulations allow a 14-day search period. It's been a week already and we still haven't unearthed a hint of evidence. I thought I should be the first to tell you. If he isn't found within a couple of days, he's most likely dead. I, I understand. Thanks for keeping me in the loop. For now, let's just keep this between you and I. I don't want Stella or your mother or anybody else to get involved. It just adds an unneeded level of stress to the situation. Yeah, I'll keep a lid on it. I'll just say the investigation is ongoing or something. Out of boy. So you honestly haven't found anything, like anything at all? I know he's a pain, but he couldn't be hiding for this long without giving any trace. It's a little more complex than that. Look, you know about Damien's past. You know about the drug use in the past. These people he got involved with, they're unreasonable. They don't have waiting lists. They don't care if you're broke. If they even think you're going to be a pain in any way, you'll be wearing cement boots. Yeah, I, I get it. I'm sorry. I've just seen this stuff too often, and it doesn't get easier. And these fires are always put under my desk. You just got to know that I'm not the bad guy here. I, I understand that. I'm just... I'm a little overwhelmed, and... I, look, I, I have to get up early in the morning at 6.30 and catch a tea, and the station's usually a zoo by then. Well, go to bed and try to get some sleep. Try not to worry. Just know we're doing everything in our power to find them. Hello? I have your brother in a nondescript location. Who is this? He has gone almost a week without any food or water. If you ever wish to see him again, you will come to 274 Burma Street with $8,000 cash and unmarked bills. Do you understand these circumstances? What type of car will you be arriving in? A, a blue Volkswagen? That I... I will be expecting a blue Volkswagen to be pulling into my driveway in 45 minutes. If you're so much as 5 minutes late, it will break all his fingers and toes. If you're 10 minutes late, you will lose his ability to walk on his own. If you arrive one hour from now, I will assume you are not arriving and put a bullet through his heart. Wait a minute, how do you expect me to get all that money in su such a short time period? I if you try to inform the authorities about this phone call, you and your brother will be dead. All of your valuables will be taken from your home. We will start targeting your loved ones. You have 42 minutes. You will regret being late. What's your name? Rodney, what's yours? My name's A. A? Yes. That's B, and that's C. And this is a gun. It's designed to eradicate problems. This transaction will take place without you becoming a problem, I hope, for your sake. 
I have your money right here. Now, where's my brother? Why does he look like that? His cooperation became... Questionable at one point. No, I mean... That's not my brother. What do you mean? Hey, look at this. What the fuck is this? Look, it's only $250. I, I know it's not much, not but... Not much? It's fucking nothing. How did you manage to slip past my radar for this long? Well, now it all adds up. Next time you should cover your tracks a little fucking better. Rodney? What? This is, this is Detective Franklin Leon. We've taken the criminals into custody and we wish for you to come with us to the station. What? I haven't done anything. We found him, Rodney. We found Damien. We found him at the Borderlands. He's intoxicated and showing signs of a struggle. But he's safe in St. Elizabeth right now. We just want to ask you a few questions about him and the events that took place today. We'll even take you to go see him if you'd like. I'd rather see him dead than behind bars. Seven years. How do you make the cops with zero trace of you even existing for seven years? Well, the point is, he's gone now. Thank you. He's taken just as much away from me. I've been waiting to see this ever since what he did to my sister.